So today I'm going to be sharing with you my new Saint Laurent Manhattan bag. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. I'm doing fantastic. And as always, I'm so excited to be back to share another video with you. So if you are here on my channel for the very first time, you're very welcome. My name is Mujisola. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to hit that notification bell button so you can be notified when I upload a brand new video. Just like myself, I know a lot of ladies, a lot of women love bags. And that was why I wanted to review this bag with you. So let's just get into it, okay? To take it out now from the dust bag. And this is what the bag looks like. So this is the Saint Laurent Manhattan bag, and this is what it looks like. At the time when I started looking for a new handbag to buy, it was about the time that Saint Laurent launched this bag. I saw it online, I wasn't really sure I would look like. So my first tip for you today would be, if you're buying a new handbag, I would say check it out online. And if you can't go into the physical store to try on the bag, to feel the texture of the bag, to see how the bag fits on you. And this is what I did. I saw it online first, it was a new collection. And I went to a store to try it on and to fit it to see how it looks on me. And this is a new arrival or a new collection in the Saint Laurent bag range. And this is the Manhattan collection. As you know, Manhattan is in New York. Of course, New York is a very busy place. So a bag that is perfect for that lady who wants to be on the go and carry so many things. I think that was why they named this bag Manhattan. I'm going to be giving you all the details of the spec of this bag so you can actually know everything about this bag. And I'm going to be modeling this bag for you. That is, I'm going to be wearing it so you can see how it looks on me. So stay tuned for that. So the dimensions for this bag is 32, 25 and 12 centimeters. This bag is made out of a smooth leather which is made out of 100% calf skin. It has a bronze stone metal hardware, which is this one right here. And I'm going to be detaching this hardware now in a bit when I finish telling you about the spec. It has a leather lining. So basically what that means is the inside also is made out of 100% leather. It has a clip double closure. So here, the closure here is clipped right here. It has a clip double closure, like I said, I'm going to be opening this to show you how it looks, okay? It has one open pocket, which is right there inside. It has five metal feet, which is this one on the bottom. One, two, three, four, five. So basically, if you're going to place your bag on the floor, the leather won't be on, uh, won't be making contact with any surface because it will be sitting on its feet right here. And the angle drop, how long this is, 10 centimeter, and it also has a long strap, which is 48 centimeters. So if you need a long strap, it has a long strap, which is 48 centimeters. So it is made in Italy. I always said in, in all of my videos when I do reviews for you, Anytime you think of Italy, you're thinking of luxury, you're thinking of luxury goods, and a lot of luxury labels, especially leather goods, are made in Italy, all right? I'm going to be detaching all this accent now to show you, just so you know exactly how it looks like. I enjoyed really wearing this bag. I brought it with me to Nigeria. I almost had too many things to carry, so I checked this bag in and it came out really nicely. Okay, I've worn it so many times. I've worn it everywhere. It's a lovely, lovely bag. I will tell you because the leather is so smooth, you have to be extremely careful so it's not scratching on surfaces. I take very good care of my product and that is why the longevity and the lifespan of my product, especially leather goods, actually last long. So also, I always think of second-hand value in case I decide to sell this bag 
in the future. Let's detach this bit so I can show you. So if you are opening this bag, this is the compacted version or style for wearing these bags. You can pull this tab out right here. You can see that. And then you can stretch it like this. You can stretch it on the other side to actually make it more roomy. The bag has one open pocket like it said, but inside it, there are two pockets inside it. There's one with zipper right here. And there's another one just on the front in case you want to pop your phone inside. And you can extend the bag so you can wear it this way. And then if you want, you can wear it that way. Right here, as you can see, it's so pretty on, it's so elegant, it's so classic. It's going to stand the test of time. It came at the right time when I was looking for a black handbag to buy when I was traveling and I've been wearing it now for a long time. So there's also the smaller version of this bag, but this is a perfect size bag for work, for going out for church, for evening. It's so easy to wear from day to night because of the size. This is a tote. They have the top handle of this version. They have it in a shade of brown called brick. If you're looking for brown, they have the black and gold. I feel like black and gold is always very elegant. It looks so lush. It looks so expensive. It's easy to wear and it's easy to style with so many things. I think the brown will go with so many things also. They also have it in burgundy in case you're looking for burgundy bag to buy. They have it in burgundy. And finally, they have mini purses of this bag. It is so beautiful. If you're looking for bag to buy, I say consider this one. So, I know a lot of people don't like to talk about money and the price of a product like this. I wouldn't be talking about it also in this video. However, I will link the direct link for you in the description box where you can check out the collection, you check out the price so you can see the range that is affordable for you. This one is perfect for me and my lifestyle and I've really had a good time wearing it, uh, especially when I traveled, went away, and since I've been back, I've been wearing it. I also wanted to share it also because of the people that I do personal shopping for, they can get more about the details. So this is what the bag looks like. So, this is my Saint Laurent Manhattan small bag in smooth leather. It's so gorgeous, it's so elegant. I truly hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and also feel free to share with your friends and family. And if you are looking to go and get this bag, I do hope you have an informed decision before buying this bag. And this is why I make videos like this. I want to thank you so very much for watching and I will speak to you soon on my next video. God bless and goodbye.